Hi guys, Frugal Gal here with a jewelry jar opening, yeah. And as I told you on another video, I bought this at the Salvation Army, but I really didn't pay anything for it because my Salvation Army does a rewards card where they put dollar amounts on that rewards card. They punch it every time you buy your items. And then once you get that card full of all, completely full of hole punches, it turns into $10. So they had this originally marked 10, they marked it down to 8, so I, I used my $10 card to get this and something else. So, I'm going to make that sound we all love, and then I'll pause you so I can get the tape off. There's stuff on the top that I really don't want to hit. Watch me hit my hand. I can't look through the camera while I'm doing this. There, we like that sound. Okay, now I'm going to pause you so I can get that tape off so you don't have to watch me do all that. I'll be right back. I've got the light on my in my phone here. Tell me if you can see this video better, if you like it better with the light on. Be right back. Okay, I got the tape off, and keep in mind, I that was right there on the top. Yeah. I buy these at Salvation Army. There's a guy over there that works there that puts these together, and he will put just about anything in a jar. I have found knives. I have found screws. Everything. So, on the top is this, and when I looked at it, I thought it was earrings, right? But on the back, it says something about 18 inches. So, <clears throat> let's open it up and see what it is. But it is earrings, isn't it? Yeah. It's earrings that they've obviously stuck on a car that maybe had a necklace on it. This is 18 inches. Oh, well, a nice little pair of earrings. Okay. And then this was on the top also. I don't know what this is. It says, change earrings. Oh, cool. I guess you can change them out. Let's see, shall we? Oh, the little dots. You can pop them out and put these little dots in there. Interchangeable colors. They're missing one. Oh, wait. It's in the bag. It's in the bag in a minute. Here's the white one. It just came out of the little thing. Well, that's neat and vintage. So you end up with one, two, three, four pair actually of earrings because you can interchange them. Hey, that's neat. I like that. Good idea. Good idea. Okay, we're going to take this out of here because it's a couple things on cards also. So what do we have here? We have one earring. Single little bow earring. Paparazzi earrings. Ooh, cat's eye. You know how much I love cat's eye. Ooh, nice to have paparazzi earrings because you know they're at least worth $5, right? Because that's what all paparazzi sell for. So, what should we do? Should we dump the stuff out? Probably. We should probably dump it out. So, let me put this stuff to the side. I know this is going to sound bad if I tilt it down, but let's start dumping this stuff out. Let's see what we got here. Saw some watches in here. Ooh, these match. Always good when you find mates. You know, those are not feel like plastic. They feel really hard like milk glass. That's broke, though. Oh, and it's signed. What's it signed? Probably Hong Kong. Where's it signed go? Let's go and see. Oh no, it's signed Western Germany. Bummer, but still, somebody could fix this other one or just you have some really good vintage earrings. You know, that you could use or something. Okay. That's just kind of zoomed in far. Let's see these. Oh, he's giving me a bunch of broken stuff. Oh, the audacity. He's giving me broken earrings. Now see, why does he do that? Why don't he just throw that away? Neither one of those have backs on him. We're going to crafting bag, though. At least I sell it as a crafting bag. He could sell it as a crafting bag. Oh, is this broke? Because this is pretty. Isn't that pretty? I bet it's broke. Is it broke? Oh, it's broke, you guys. Man. I mean, I don't mind if they sell broken jewelry, but I do think they ought to tell you it's broken. Okay, so so far we've got a pile of broken jewelry over there. I have a feeling that this theme might continue. Well, that one's not broken. That's kind of neat. It's raised up. Get that over there in case we find its mate. And that one is not broken. It's that one's mate. It's signed on the back also. Probably says Hong Kong. Yes, it says Hong Kong. Okay. Those over there, because they're not broken. Ooh, that's a nice earring. I like that. 
here. Is that fine? No. Oh, here's the other one with this one. These are actually look, these are metal, but they're better metal than those ones like from the 80s that hurt your ears. Okay. I don't know, I call these button earrings. Okay, this is just a plastic bracelet. Plastic, plastic bangle. I didn't know I'd be sorting earrings. I didn't know that mainly this was earrings. Yeah, that's pretty. This one's pretty. Uh, a watch. Face. Uh, what is that? It's a diamond quartz. I'm going to have to turn that back into a watch. Put a band on it. Whoops, you out blur, you been drinking again? Knock it off. Stop that. Told you. Can't hold your liquor. Let's see what earrings. Nice. We'll go on an earring lot. You guys you need to knock it with the drink in though, really seriously. Well there's a the back of a watch that we're probably gonna find later. There's a watch band. I just love that he gave me a watch band. It's so nice of him. Ooh, I like that. I just like how that looks. This pendant is nice. Nothing wrong with it. Oh, it's got an earring. Oh, it's got an earring inside of it. Oh, it's because it's magnetic, isn't it? Yeah, it's a magnetic pendant. So the earring's like, I don't want to let go of it. Look at that. It's magnetic. Oh, it's a nice pendant. Nice pendant. I'd have been more upset if I'd actually bought this. But, I did spend my reward money on it. What is this? That is, yeah, I want to, yeah, you would make quite an impression where I'm entering. We'll put it over here in case we find it tonight. You blurry about, you're blurry out again. I'm trying to see if I can find any that look alike. What is this? Oh, it's a watch face. That's kind of neat. You could use that in uh, some kind of arts and craft project. We'll put that over there. Oh, that's probably the back to that, isn't it? Oh, well, looky there. I told you we'd find it. Nope, never mind. I spoke too soon. It doesn't fit it. Ooh, these are pretty. I like French hook earrings. Th those are just plastic beads. But it's a pretty, not plastic, but very pretty. Very pretty. That's interesting. That, I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to dump some more out so maybe we have some more mates. What's this? A little piece of chain? No. Sorry about my squeaking table. Can't help it. i got to put my elbows down. I don't, you yeah. know? No, it's an earring chains off it. Okay, let's dump some more stuff out. Hey, here's that. Is that that bow earring that was a single earring? It is. Look at there. We found the bow that goes on here. What? So that's cool. So we actually have it. Nice. Blurry again. Oh, look. We do have a mate to that one. Well, I tell you what. That is unique. Isn't it? Yeah, put that over there. Let's just dump the rest of it out. Oh, what's this? What is this? Oh! Key retriever. I thought it was going to be a... Oh. I thought it was going to be a tape measure. I was going to get excited because I could clip it to my purse. That one when I'm out thrift shopping. Thrift shopping? Okay, well, it's late. One. I never can wear these because they're not big enough. That's actually not plastic. That's metal. It's just kind of neat. But look at that. Like a big ring. I will sell that. I would sell it. Oh, I just broke it. <laughs> Melissa, it goes like that. Well, we're not just a bow. You look good in my piddle's hair. Aww. 
What if it's a, what if it's a boy poodle, though? I'm choking it anyway. We'll take it off. Sorry. Told you it's late. Hey, I saw the other ones of these earrings. Of those earrings. Well, I, maybe that's the one I saw. Never mind. Here is a watch. Oh, look. It's our favorite brand, Geneva. But I can... Wait a minute. Is it missing stone? This will have a stone there. Oh, no. Yeah, I think it is. Yes. Oh, how dare he. Oh, he must not like paparazzi jewelry. He just keeps throwing here. Oh, I found it. Ha, ha. I thought you were going to be one anyway, don't you? I don't think so, buddy. Paparazzi. Pa, 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 paparazzi. What's in the song? Lady Gaga. <laughs> Did I know something that was relevant and, and of age? That's amazing because I don't know things like that. That's just some baby old earrings. Do you like hoops? I've got hoops for you. I'm telling you, I saw another one of these. Do you guys see it? Here, look. Yeah, I'll, I'll upload this like two days. I've already found it. Or am I just going to see in the same one? I'll put a badge thing in there. Ooh, now see, that's what I use. It's a pretty badge, I think. But it's not jewelry. I told him. I told him over. There was something in here that looked like a bullet. Seriously. It, told you. Okay. Now this would make sense if it's like you unscrew it and it's like a pin. Or. Something. What is it? That's a bullet, right? But what's the purpose of it? It doesn't come undone. I gotta pause this and figure this out. I'll come back and tell you. Okay, it's nothing, but nothing. I even got my old person jar gripper thing out. Yes, I have one of these because as you get older, your hands get sore. It's a little thing called arthritis. And sometimes we're not all 38 like Barbie. And we have to open jars with these, okay? And I try to do that. And I tried, well, see, it's got a seam there. So I thought, well... Because I've seen these, like, as lighters. And I've seen them as pins. But this is absolutely nothing. It's frustrating me. We have a watch. We definitely know we have a watch. Is this another nice Geneva? It is. Just says quartz. Just says quartz. Not a bad watch. I got a battery changing kit and everything. Decent watch. So somebody in one of my groups, they buy watches and they put batteries in them and they sell them. They make money. Oh, that's a Timex. Sometimes I just uh, put them on eBay without changing the batteries, and people buy them. Probably, you know, put a battery in, fix it, and they make money. I made my money. That's probably just those quartz too, in there. Yeah, yeah, what's it say? Ooh, quit drinking, you all. What does it say? I'm waiting for. It's got a very scratched lens, so it looks to be old. Maybe it's worth something. Let's see what it says on the back. It says Bolivia Quartz, so that's good. Huh. It has a... Hmm, I gotta look at that closer. Sorry about my nails. I'm waiting for my rarity nails. I sell rarity nails. If you guys don't know, quit drinking, you're making me dizzy. Um, they're nail strips, real nail polish strips that you put on. And I'll show you the ones I've ordered. They don't come in yet. I'm going to have to put this on pause and get loop loo out and look at this. I'll be right back. It is. It says Caravel by Bolivia. I looked it up. Oh, I'm sorry about my... I am not dirty. It is just... That's the glue left over from my thing. Anyway. Uh, I will show you guys my rarity nails. When I do. Um, it's sold like by Macy's and JCPenney. So not a great, great watch. I'll probably not bother changing the battery. It's got a really scratched... Um, glass. Haha, ha, there they are. You didn't tell me. They're right in front of us. These are like leopard print or whatever and they got little sparklies on them. They're plastic. Remember Valley Girl? You were a kid of the 80s. You know what Valley Girl speak is. 